Like most of us, I used to think that once a mob lost in a mob vote, it was gone forever. But hold your pickaxes, because it's very likely that the copper golem will be added in the near future. And maybe already in 1.21. Why, you might think? Let's break it down. Mojang introduced the first mob vote in 2017, where we were presented four mobs. And there was one thing that Jens made very clear. And remember to vote, because the three ones that you don't vote for, they will be gone forever. Such a shame, because the other three mobs were so cool. But then the year after, in 2018, we had a biome vote instead of a mob vote. And this time, the rules were different. The biomes that didn't make it weren't doomed for good, but were promised a return in a future update. Although we have not seen an update for most of these biomes, the swamp is the only biome that eventually was added in a wild update. However, since that biome vote, it's been a bit of a mystery whether this applies to the mob votes as well. Mojin did mention at some point that these mobs would be added to the ID shelf for future consideration. You've probably heard about the community's movement to end the mob vote. People are tired of seeing their favorite mobs lose and disappear forever. That's why Vubui was very clear when the penguin was the first to lose this year's mob vote. Don't feel too bad for the penguin. Remember our little frog friends didn't win the vote either, but they still managed to hop their way into the game. Mojang heard the outcry and reassured the community that mob vote losers could still make it to the game. So back to the copper golem. Why, out of all 14 mob vote losers, would the copper golem be the one to be added in the next update? It's not that it's the oldest candidate, right? Well, it has everything to do with one of the new features announced for the 1.21 update. The trial chambers. As you've probably noticed, there is a lot of copper related blocks to find in these chambers. In fact, there are even some new copper blocks that will be added to this new update. And this is only the beginning. Mojang will announce more features for 1.21, just like they did last year. Actually, the best features for 1.20 were some of the latest announced features, like cherry blossom and armor trims. So, wouldn't it make a lot of sense for the copper golem to be added now? Copper is everywhere in the overworld, but its uses are pretty limited. Building blocks, lightning rods, spy glasses and brushes. It's time for more possibilities. And we're already seeing them in the trial chambers. With copper doors, trap doors and even a fancy copper light source. If there's ever been a time for the copper golem, it's now. This actually makes even more sense than its initial release in 1.18. Especially with these new copper blocks. But what about a tough golem? There are new tough blocks in these chambers too. Could they make their way into the update as well? What's your thought on it? Share them in the comments and make sure to subscribe so you won't miss any future videos.